Well, hello there. Are you ready to make millions and millions of dollars? All you need to do is send me $1,000 and then I will send you $5,000 back in 72 hours. No questions asked. I have a secret, a proprietary day trading system that makes millions in returns and I want to you I want you to make millions as well. are you losing money in the stock market are you tired of losing money in the stock market why don't you hire a professional a professional day trader like myself so that you can become a millionaire just like me and you can also get the bag get the bag of money I'm tired of not having money are you tired of being broke are you tired of being poor I can change all of that I can make you richer than richer guy I can make you so rich it'll be It'll be, you'll be super rich. You'll have so much money that you're going to need multiple briefcases to keep all your money in. What's going on guys? Patrick here. And today I want to talk about something that a lot of people are having issues with something. I, I, it's mind blowing to say the least. So recently, or I guess really over the last year or so, there's been a lot of scammers and a lot of people basically using YouTubers profiles like myself and other YouTubers out there. They message people on Facebook. They message people on Instagram promising that if they give them a thousand dollars then they'll give them $3,000 within 72 hours or saying, Hey, you know, things like if you send me your money, I'll trade for you. And then you can have a percentage of that. Send me $2,000. And then within 72 hours, I'll send you $10,000. I don't know about you guys, but to me, I would make that deal. That seems like a really good deal, right? It's mind blowing to think that people out there are being scammed every single day and they're believing really anyone messages them on Facebook or Instagram or anything like that. Do you really think that, that me or, you know, myself or other YouTubers or other day traders would be out there sitting on Facebook messaging people, asking them for $2,000 or $1,000 or just in general offering services via Facebook Messenger. You've got to really ask yourself that question. Warren Buffett is out there messaging people on Instagram, you know, asking for money to day trade with. Well, you probably should just go ahead and give them your money anyway cuz you, you you're going the money you're going to lose that money either way cuz you uh, you're just not something's not going on. You're not connecting the dots, right? You're not putting the dots together. And this is what's even funnier is that these people message you know, people like you, they message my subscribers and normally they're not from America. And that's not to say that there's not scam artists in America, but the English that they speak is broken English. So people get messages and the messages start out with like, hello, sir. My name is Patrick. I like to day trade. Something about that just seems fishy. When somebody messages me and they don't even really speak English, there's, there's something questionable already right there. Mind blowing you know, to think that people actually believe this. People actually fall for this. If you see somebody post on Twitter that if you send them $1,000, they'll then send you $2,000 in return. Don't believe it, people. Don't believe, pretty much don't believe anything that you read on the internet or Instagram or Facebook or anything like that. Just be, let's, let's be smart here, people. First off, for any company out there who is approached by anyone using the name Patrick Whelan on Telegram or WhatsApp or Facebook or anything like that, it's not me. I am not messaging. I'm not messaging anyone first off, but I'm definitely not messaging people out there offering to make videos about their companies or about their cryptocurrency project for a hundred dollars. I don't even answer emails for a hundred dollars. So right there, that should be one major flag. The other day I had a cryptocurrency project that was really mad saying that I scammed them, that I was going to make three videos for a hundred dollars that right there that's the red flag alone it, no why would i make videos why would i make three videos of a cryptocurrency project that no one's even heard of for a hundred dollars let's be honest if you want to pay me ten thousand dollars then i might possibly make the video right there red flag another red flag is if you see the account and they have things like went to college at oxford you know went to oxford college i, I didn't go to college so that right there will tell you that it's obviously a scammer and the broken English thing. If they don't speak fluent English, if they're, you know, if the words don't make sense. If they're saying things like I make day trades with your money and then money makes money. 
if, you know, if it doesn't sound like an actual person who speaks English, there's a pretty good chance that it's a scam artist as well. As you can see, I, you know, obviously I don't speak the greatest English. I'm not the best speaker ever, but I have been speaking English my entire life, all 32 years. So I really have no reason to speak broken English. Now, broken Spanish, yes. If you get a message from me and it's in Spanish and it's broken, well, then it, it it's not me, but it, it could be me because you get it. You know what I mean? So. Those are some red flags right off the bat. And then the biggest red flag, at the end of the day, the biggest red flag out of all of them is successful business people, people with money, people who are successful really in anything, are not spending time messaging random people on Facebook or Instagram offering to make money for them because they're already making money and they don't need to message random people on Instagram or Facebook to try to get money from them to make more money. That's not, you don't, it just, you don't need to do that, right? If you're successful and you make a lot of money, why would I spend any time begging people for money on Facebook? So please, please people use your brains. All right. I know that 99, 99% of you guys who subscribe to my channel and, I, and I'll say, wait, let's, I'll say most of you guys who subscribe to my channel, understand this overall idea. I, I think most people understand that you got to be smart. All right. You got to think a little bit. You got to be skeptical of everything and you really got to be careful on the internet today. Don't sign up for websites that promise big returns. Don't sign up for chat rooms that promise big returns. Don't sign up for anything that promises big returns, especially Forex. Stay away from Forex brokers. Pretty much, I would stay away from Forex in general, but if you're going to trade Forex, trade for trade with Forex brokers that are actually you know, they have some type of law. They're in some type of country like uh, America, the U.S. They're somewhere that's safer than somewhere like Kazakhstan. If the place that you're signing up for to day trade, if their offices are in Kazakhstan or you know Zimbabwe, if the offices of the company are in Zimbabwe, then you might want to stay away from putting your money into these places. So please, people, this is the last time. I posted about it a hundred times on Instagram. I posted about it on Twitter. I posted about it on stock twist. And now I'm posting about it here on YouTube one more time, finally, so that companies stop getting scammed, hopefully. And everybody else stops getting scammed by these scam artists. Cause it's not me. I'm not making profiles on telegram, messaging people, trying to promote their products. I'm not doing that. So with that said, please be smart. Don't put your money places that you can't get the money back. If it's, you know, places like cryptocurrency.com, biggestinvesting.com, cryptocurrency. Be very skeptical. Be very skeptical of everything that you read online, especially when it comes to financial things, money in general. If it's anything to do with money, be very, 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 be very, very, very skeptical. And hopefully you guys see this video and you stop messaging me. I get messages every single day, emails every single day from companies, from people asking me if I'm messaging if I'm messaging them on Facebook. I'm not on Facebook messaging anyone. I'm I'm just not, you know? I'm not doing that. I got better things to do with my life. So, please be smart, be careful, be skeptical, you know? It's all that's all I can do. I'm trying. I'm trying to help you by saving you lots of heartache and anguish by losing money online, but I can only do so much. So here's my last and final attempt at hopefully saving somebody from losing money for, from these scammers. So please be smart, be smart. If you're subscribed to my channel, I'm hoping that you're smart already, but I'm thinking that maybe the people who aren't subscribed are the people who are getting scammed. That's, that's the way we look at it. The people who are not subscribed to my channel are the, probably the ones who are getting scammed because they're not smart enough to subscribe to my channel. So if you're smart and you're not already subscribed, Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Other than that, let's go.